download Wakanda is about two hours long or something, I think. So I have like three, four, maybe if you explore a lot, five hours of blind gameplay still ahead of me. Oh my god, I have the hiccups. Yay, low res, doc. I cannot skip this. Which is kind of a shame. Because I'm only get really coming here for two side quests. To hand one side quest in. And to see if I can get one another. Now, 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 this is I <laughs> the fuck. Somebody probably I need to talk to someone to trigger that probably. Question is who? I forgot. We need to go to the citadel. I don't know. I need to go to the citadel anyways. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of already heard this this news Hanar flash call them should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Citadel Tower. Oh, actually, you see, the um, the side quest that I want to trigger is a side quest of a girl who is suicidal. But now, because I I had the uh, the walkthrough, the guide, I I had that for Mass Effect One. Uh, I don't have it here in Japan, obviously, but um. Something now reminds me, because I was like, what triggers it? That the choice in the very beginning when you make your character, you know, your your background, I think that has something to do with it. I think, because, you know, I, I chose that I was a survivor of a coups. That might not be the proper one to trigger it. I might be wrong there, but I don't know. Any news? Did you find my brother yet? I found your brother's body. His ship was attacked by privateers. Willem's dead? I guess I should have expected this. When his ship dropped out of contact, I just knew. But I kept hoping he might still be alive. Yeah. I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you for finding him. It's better to know one way or the other. That's what they say, right? Please excuse me. I need to go make arrangements for his funeral. Alright, um... Well, that was quick. That means I'm gonna leave the city though again. Not two pharaohs. Pharaohs! <laughs> Up the elevator again? That was a nice stop. I'd love to see what the Normandy can do in a fight. How so? The Normandy is built for stealth, not combat. But the stealth drive adds a new tactical level to space combat as we know it. Surprise attacks, undetected flanking maneuvers. I had forgotten the Turian appreciation for tactics and strategy. With respect, I hope we avoid ship-to-ship -ship combat entirely. Oh well. 
Look at our shadows. Look at Liara's shadow, my shadow emerging. Do you see that, Liara? It's, it is a sign of you and me. <gasps> Two minds emerge. Oh, shit. The fuck? Okay, Pharaohs with my ladies' team of Liara and Tali. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Yeah, good for you, lady. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Bitches. What is here? What's in Hercules? I don't know what's there, but I just need to, you know, find that out as well. Message coming in. Patching it through. Oh. Normandy, this is Alliance Command. We're detecting your presence in the Attican Beta Cluster. Indeed. One of our surveillance drones was gathering intel on Geth activities in the region when it was spotted and shot down. You need to go groundside and recover the drone's data module before the Geth find it. Roger that. Roger that. It's probably not this one. Or it is. Oh shit. All right. Uh, so let's well, let's get down there then. That sky, though. Okay, so, uh, let's see, where are we? We are here, there's something there. And that is where the probe... Oh, I need to cross those mountains, though. Shit! That's just great. Wow, there's a level one hazard? What kind of hazard? The fuck? Radiation or something? I don't know. Doesn't seem very cold or something. There were three things that the armor would not protect against. That would those were heat, cold. Oh, toxic. Maybe poisonous here. Oh, no. Please don't say I need to go up there. Please don't say I need to go up there. Please don't say I need to, I need to go up there. God damn it. Oh, look at those mountains. <gasps> okay, there it is. Come on. Don't be a bitch and just get up there. Let's get this shit over with. Oh shit. Oh dear god. What the fuck is that? Whoa! Moving out. The hell? Looks beautiful. Looks like a water bubble. Which I just want to pop. Examining the strange Prothean artifact reveals a small irregular slot on the underside of the surface. Remembering the strange trinket you received from a Sari concert on the Citadel, you pull it out and place it into the slot. The ball explodes in a brilliant flash of white light. 
momentarily blinding and disorienting you. Slowly, slowly your senses return as you wake from a deep sleep. You are alone in the forest, through, though you are not far from the caves you share with the others of your tribe. There is a pain and a small lump in the back of your skull, as if a chip of flint has been forced under the surface of the skin. Leading on your bone-tipped spear for support, you rise to your feet. A sound draws your attention upwards, where a strange creature hovers high above you. It's unlike the birds you hunt by the lake's edge. It has no head and no wings, yet somehow it flies. It is a beast of shining silver hanging motionless in the sky like a cloud. You sense... The fuck is this? Raising... Oh my god, it's more. Raising a hairy fist, you shake your spear at it in anger, and the creature rises up quickly until it disappears from view. With a satisfied grunt, you make your way back to your caves and the rest of the tribe. You fall into familiar patterns of life, the hunt for food, the struggle to claim and keep a mate, the battles against other tribes that would claim your territory, days roll into nights and back into days. Each time you rise from sleep, there is the sensation that you are not alone, that some other is with you, is with you sharing all you see, hear and feel. All these times, your hand goes to the strange lump at the back of your skull, you remember the silver creature in the sky. The air grows colder, winter falls, you must range farther for food, clutching the first tight against you to ward off the chill. It is one of these long hunts that the strange birds return. returns. You hear it before you see it. It's called a deafening roar as it descends from above, swooping down on you. A single great eye opens on the underbelly, a glowing red orb. You try to run, but a lingered red light extends. What the fuck is this shit? Oh my god, there's more! You wake an instant later to find yourself on a lit Tanya, lying on your back, the Prothean artifact looming above you, undamaged, and your companions standing over you. They help you to your feet, puzzled. There was a flash of light and you just sort of toppled over, one explains. Are you okay, Shepard? The other asks. You don't answer right away, wondering at the implications or what you have seen. The memories of a crow magnon hunter captured by an implanted Prothean data recorder. How long did they study the primitive humans observing them? Analyzing the results at their base on Mars and what if anything Did they learn from us? I'm fine. You finally reply realizing this is a mystery. What the fuck is this suddenly role-playing reading shit? What the hell? But was that it? Is there is there Well, whatever Lead on, Commander. That was weird. Okay, now I have to get out of here. I'm heading north. Dun -dun 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 -dun. This should be. Oh shit! Not as easy as I thought. God damn it. Oh, come on. Really now? Really now? I might just go to the to the that drone and secure that and then go to the to get the uh, debris thing all right we're getting close gonna trigger like death if I touch it the fuck are these
This is the surveillance drone, but where is the data module? A monkey-like creature seems to have made off with a data module. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Oh no. Why? <laughs> Are you really gonna let me do it? Oh dear, oh my god. Are you serious? Oh no, and that we have got that one over there. I need to kill monkeys. Are you. F now it be it's becoming frustrating. Do 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 do. Got it. Okay, now monkey, monkey see, monkey do. I wonder if it's a specific one or like random. I don't know. I'm just gonna fucking slaughter all of those monkeys. That's one thing I know. What up? Fuck. Remind me to stay on your good side, Commander. This is why you humans have such a violent reputation. Indeed. Indeed we do. Well, is it here? Oh hey. Hey, it's not it's not doing anything. Doesn't seem like it's here. So that's just great. Oh, it's not doing anything if I shoot. Interesting. Not even giving me an explosion. I cannot believe I'm actually killing monkeys here when the fucking galaxy is at stake. What up? They're just wandering around aimlessly. There's one still alive? Yes, there is. How about now? Hello? Oh, no, nothing here. Well, I don't want to traverse that, so I'm gonna drive around it, which is possible if I'm led to believe by the map. I'm so fr also frustrated that you cannot look at your map and drive at the same time. That would be so much more convenient. I might have... I might take an afternoon nap after this or something, I don't know. Okay, so the debris is close to here. Oh. I'm on my way. Uh, I'm gonna use this. I still have, still have 308, 380 Omni Gel. Incredible. Maybe if there are Geth near the monkeys, that's the right one. I don't know. Slaughtering those apes. Wow. 
Well, I guess that's not the right one either. You're still alive. You're still alive. Now what? That's pretty much my only my, my last chance. Or is it? Yeah it is. It's not there, I don't know. 